Hello and welcome back to Views on the Road. I'm your host, Steph, and today we're making the famous chichis enchiladas. You'll need flour tortillas, three cups of half and half, one fourth of a teaspoon of white pepper, one teaspoon of chicken bouillon, three dashes of nutmeg, a dash of paprika, two tablespoons of butter, one tablespoon of all-purpose flour, half an onion, deveined shrimp, crab meat, and two cups of cheese. Place your burner on a medium heat and add your butter. Once your butter melts, you're gonna add your all-purpose flour. Give that a loving mix and continue to cook for about 10 to 15 seconds. And be careful because you do not wanna burn what we have going on. Add your half and half, white pepper, chicken bouillon, a few dashes of nutmeg, and combine all your loving ingredients. And you just want to wait for all your ingredients to come to temperature. You're going to see that it's going to start to boil on the sides. And that's when you want to add your cheese. Turn your burner off and give that a loving mix. And you're going to continue to mix until all your cheese is well incorporated into your sauce. And it doesn't take that long to melt the cheese into your sauce. Once you've melted your cheese into your sauce, you're going to take most of it and set it to the side. With the remaining sauce, you're gonna place your burner on a low temperature. You're gonna add your onions, shrimp, and your crab. Give that a gentle mix and combine all your ingredients. You wanna make sure that you coat all your seafood with the sauce. Once you combine your ingredients, you're gonna switch your burner to a medium heat and you're gonna to continue to cook for a minute and a half to two. And in the meantime, I'm gonna start warming up my tortillas. If for some reason you see that it's getting too dry in there, you can add one tablespoon of milk. All you want to do is continue to cook till your shrimp turn pink and go ahead and turn your burner off. Add some of your sauce to the bottom of your baking dish and set it to the side while we assemble our enchiladas. Take your filling and place it on your tortilla. And roll it up. Place it in your baking dish and continue with your remaining enchiladas. Next, you're going to pour your sauce right over the top. Next, you're going to place your cheese right on the top. And slightly sprinkle some paprika over the top. And you're going to bake at 380 degrees for 15 to 20 minutes. As soon as you see your cheese has melted, it's time for them to come out. For those of you that don't know about famous chichis enchiladas and their salsa, it's a restaurant that closed down from the Midwest that a lot of you miss, so I'm so grateful that I'm able to recreate this recipe for you. And boom done, we have some delicious chichis enchiladas. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited for a big bite. <laughs> it smells so good. I'm gonna need somebody very special to say ah. Uh. And keep the request coming because I'm happy to recreate any recipe that you guys would like, even if it's not Mexican food. Mmm. If for some reason you're in Mexico and you're looking for these kind of uh, enchiladas, you would call them encremadas because they're made with cream. Mmm. Well, that happened quick. <laughs> As always, Cloud and I are wishing you the best. We absolutely adore you. And on that one, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Adios.